Ever pondered the significance of first aid knowledge in everyday life? Welcome to this enlightening journey where we unravel the power of first aid and how it can turn ordinary folks into everyday heroes. We begin with a scenario that may be all too familiar. Imagine this, you're at a family barbecue and suddenly a relative collapses. Panic ensues, but the knowledge of basic life support skills can be the difference between life and death. First and foremost, check for responsiveness. Shake the person gently and ask loudly, are you okay? If there's no response, it's time to spring into action. Dial your country's emergency number and immediately begin chest compressions. Place the heel of your hand on the center of the person's chest. Put your other hand on top, interlock your fingers and start pushing hard and fast. Around 100 to 120 compressions per minute. Remember the tune Stayin' Alive by the Bee Gees? That's your rhythm. After 30 compressions, tilt the person's head back slightly to open the airway. Pinch the nose shut and give two rescue breaths, making the chest rise with each one. This cycle of 30 compressions and two breaths is known as CPR, cardiopulmonary resuscitation. But what if you have an AED, an automated external defibrillator, on hand? AEDs can be a game changer. Simply turn on the AED, and it will guide you with voice prompts. Attach the electrode pads to the person's chest as shown in the AED's diagram. The AED will then analyze the person's heart rhythm and instruct you whether to deliver a shock or continue CPR. Now let's shift gears and talk about common injuries, starting with wounds. If someone has a wound, apply pressure with a clean cloth to stop the bleeding. Clean the wound with water and mild soap, then apply a bandage. What about burns? Firstly, cool the burn under cool running water for at least 10 minutes. Cover the burn with a plastic wrap or a clean, non-fluffy cloth. Do not apply creams or lotions as they can cause infection. Fractures and sprains can be tricky, but they're manageable. If you suspect a fracture, try to immobilize the injured area with a splint or a sling. For sprains, remember the acronym RICE, Rest, Ice, Compression, and Elevation. To recap, we've explored basic life support skills, including CPR and AED usage. We've also delved into administering first aid for common injuries such as wounds, burns, fractures, and sprains. In emergency situations, the power to make a difference lies in your hands. With knowledge and composure, anyone can become an everyday hero. Remember, the aim of first aid is not to provide a cure. It's to alleviate suffering, prevent further illness or injury, and to save lives. So equip yourself with first aid knowledge and skills because you never know when you might need them. Stay safe, stay prepared, and remember, every second counts when a life is on the line. This is your call to action, your journey to becoming an everyday hero. Until next time, remember, first aid first because it matters.